I have a purse that I've needed to show you and I'm going to share my honest opinion. Hey, welcome to the Luxury Playlist. I am Portia Franklin. I'm super excited that you are here. Let's get into this quick review. I have a purse that I've needed to show you and I'm going to share my honest opinion. I will share. Um, yeah, let's just get into it. If you're interested moving forward with this bag, I'll have all the information down below. You can contact me and ask me personally. Contact me on Instagram. Uh, that's the best place to connect with me and just send me a quick DM. There's a link below. You can get a free shopping guide in the link, in the first link that you see in the description box. That's gonna give you my DHgate shopping guide because I'm obsessed with DHgate. We love to see all the things there. So I have a list of things that I have received personally or uh, my girlfriends have gotten and they absolutely love. So only the best and here we go. Let's get into it. All right, so I have this bag. I have not used it. I've had it for a while now, but I wasn't in love with it when I got it. So it's been taking me a while <laughs> to even get back in the groove of doing the review so this is the neo alma it's supposed to be it says the bb this is the bigger one this is like the mm yet the coloring of this this is a replica i received this as a gift to share with you guys and it is not an exact so as you know on this channel i give you all information on getting the best no questions asked when you're out and about with your bag like you should feel just really confident and i bring you the best when i work with a private seller i really make sure and if it's not then i'm not going to share it but i want to do this because you have to be aware let me rephrase that I encourage you to be aware of the quality of bags that you're purchasing and to make sure that what you are expecting is actually what you're getting, what you're paying for. Now, price is gonna matter, so the lower the price, the more likely you're not gonna get a mere quality bag, right? So there are levels of quality in this arena so i have done a little bit of research on this bag when i picked this bag the bag is supposed to have a purple inside this bag has this color inside now the mini bb of this bag which is like the smallest bag in this is that more orange which is a beautiful color it feels nice but this bag, it's the bigger bag, it's the medium bag, and this is supposed to be purple, which I will show you. Now I have this bag. No, I don't know if you can tell the difference of quality in the leather. Let me know in the comments if you can tell the difference in quality. I can. I can in person. This bag is pretty dull. It's very flimsy and to be honest, the Almas that I know of are very firm all the way around. So yeah. And then the, what I was expecting, I was expecting, oh, this bag is full of stuff, <laughs> but I was expecting this royal purple color to be in this bag. Okay. So that's my first discrepancy. <laughs> It's not firm, it's super flimsy. Now, if you are somebody that doesn't mind what the quality is looking like, I go, I literally go to Louis Vuitton. I feel, touch, and smell these bags. And so I'm pretty obsessed with like the quality and like I'm very intrigued that we can get these bags for like a fraction of the cost and still have the look obsessed. But I'm telling you, I'm telling you that to tell you that I'm not impressed with the quality of this bag, just to be honest, okay? So I will give you the information. If you like this bag and you want it to be mirror image, I'll give you information. I will let you know where to get it, okay? Uh, this bag, I love the size. I love the, the space inside. Again, I just am not, I'm not sold out on the, the quality of this particular bag. 
in regards to the comparison of the authentic okay so that's my only yeah qualm with this is it's not it's not giving um what she needs to be giving in my eyes if you love this let me know dm me if you want this bag <laughs> because i'm probably gonna have to find her a new home i'm just gonna have to find her a new home so but this is the alma black leather imprint bag so that's my review on that i am not impressed with this one in particular but again i am a luxury quality replica mirror image whatever snob so um <laughs> i don't want to have to walk around second guessing my bag i don't want you to even know so if you know me then you know but if you don't know me and you see my bag i don't want you to be like oh that's fake right like <laughs> I want to be able to go out and about and and know that this bag is on point and we're feeling all the things that our luxury bags bring up. So I don't know if that made sense or if that was even a good video, but here we are. <laughs> that was my um, commitment to making a video on this bag. Yeah, we are good. So if you want to see the next video, I have more to come next video. We got our Dior. Dior. <laughs> so we'll talk to you soon. I'll see you in the next video.